new form of treatment is helping addicts regain control of their lives. ABC 10 News reporter Jared Aaron takes an in-depth look at how it uses brain imaging and mental exercises to get results. I tried everything a bit more than once, I'll just say that much. For years, Julia Solomon struggled with addiction. Towards the end, it was a lot of uh, stimulants, so cocaine, Vyvanse, Adderall. I was um, crushing it up and snorting it off the back of the toilet at work, which is, you know, disgusting and um, made perfect sense at the time. The UC San Diego grad told our affiliate in Houston she was in and out of rehab, but nothing worked. A, I wasn't ready. B, my brain just was not functioning at a level that would allow me to stay sober. Until she found Neurologix. The Southern California-based company offers a new way to help addicts by mapping their brains. Looks at 293 domains of the brain. Neurologix chairwoman Karen Odell Barber explains their technology maps neural pathways, seeing how the brain responds in different situations. Patients wear a cap like this while spending two hours doing specially designed brain exercises. And we look at the brain under task at the speed of actual thought. We're the only company who can do that. That first session creates a map of the brain and a roadmap for treatment. Over the next four months, patients meet with a coach three times per week for treatment specifically tailored to their brain. You would then go through this series of exercises like a personal trainer for your brain. The treatment is FDA approved and Odell Barber says they've already helped more than 21,000 people raise their IQ an average of 15 to 18 points. Higher IQ helps the brain with stress management and impulse control, two things that help fight addiction. If you tell someone, call your sponsor, recognize the signs of relapse, and you don't remember that in the time that you are stressed, you can't put those wonderful tools into action. The company says 80% of their patients fighting addiction are sober at the 18 month mark. That's a significantly higher success rate than the national average. A recent study found only 15% stay sober for 12 months. For Julia, it's been six years and she believes anyone struggling like she did should try it. And it sounds like magic when you talk about it. Um, and it is, it is. I think we're at a point now where science can really help addicts. Jared Aarons, ABC 10 News. Well, those numbers were really incredible. Neurologic says their treatment can also help people with ADHD, learning disabilities, autism, and traumatic brain injuries. It costs $20,000 though. The company says they are working to get insurance plans to cover it to make it more available to more people.